and welcome to the second part of my video about Advanced Squad Leader Starter Kit uh, Retaking Via Ville playthrough. And uh, we already have uh, turns 1 and 2, and after this turn, two turns, the uh, situation is not quite bad for Americans, I guess, because they still hold uh, three of the victory points and, and they are fighting with Germans for the, uh, about the fourth one. And so far, uh, German Americans are doing quite fine. Uh, Germans, well, not much because a lot of their units are is broken. So uh, this this uh, this uh, situation cannot be good because Americans are still gaining reinforcements, and there's more reinforcements to come for both sides actually. But Americans are have already clear way to Vieville. So. Uh, I'm not sure if Germans will manage to do uh, some uh, good stuff in this game, uh, le but let's uh, check check it out. We are starting with turn three, and this is a German. And uh, German, f there there is going to be a German faces first. So let's check. We have uh, two uh, German uh, squads with a commander entering from the this part of the board so how what I'm going to do with them <laughs> I think I will do something like that I will make them go here and that's where they're going to enter I might actually zoom a bit oh that should be good and now, now we can ro uh, uh, rally our units we are starting with Germans of course First, this commander is trying to rally these two squads. And himself, of course, first, because he needs to rally himself to rally these squads later. So let's start with him. My bad. This is bad because uh, we rolled 12, and this means that he's wounded. He is wounded, and I have to roll for severity on this wound. If I would roll 5 or, or, five or 6, he's eliminated. Oh no, no, he is not eliminated, but he's wounded. So because of that, his morale and his leadership skill are lowered by one. So he he has eight one, but be, uh, eight minus one. But because of the wound, he has seven and zero. So that was very unlucky roll. And next we have here, uh, we, there is one broken squad, and commander tries to rally this broken squad. It is. 12, we have, mi sorry, it is 8, we have minus 1 because of the commander and minus 1 because of the woods, so it is 6, it is lower than 7, so German half squad is rallied. Okay, uh, there is no commander here and no commander there, there but we can rally one of our two unit uh, and it will be self-rally. And when you perform a self-rally, you need to add plus one to the die roll. So I'm trying to rally these guys, and we have minus one because they are in the building, and plus one because this is self-rally. So they did it. Okay, that's good. And I'm removing this desperation morale counter. And now Americans. Uh, Americans. Uh, what are the... Okay, here. I will try to remove this, uh, sorry, to rally this squad. Oh, they are reduced, so I need an American half squad counter with 337 value. Mm -hmm. It's always a problem to find a counter you are looking for. You might have a lot of them, but when you look for the one certain counter, you still have a problem to find it. That's uh, something I think I'm pretty sure everyone uh, meets. Okay, it is here, so it was this uh, unit is eliminated. And also, because I ra ra uh, I get 12, no, sorry, no, they are just Reduced. Okay, that's fine. No, no, this is not fine, but that's what happened. Okay, and now here 
we can also try to rally this squad. We have a commander which is minus one. They are in the building, so we have minus two, and they have uh, plus four because of the desperation morale counter. So we have plus two modifier. And let's make a roll. It is eleven, so nothing. They are st they they remain broken. <clears throat> this is not good. Not good. The situation is starting to be harder for Americans. Okay, uh, so that's all when it comes to the rally phase and we are moving to the prep fire phase. Uh, and the question is if Germans are about to fire anywhere. I think they, uh, they actually uh, might try to do something. First them. One, two, three, four, five. So they are firing on them with firepower of two and no modifiers. Five. Oh, this might be effective. We have 5 in the firepower column of 2, so it is normal morale check for Americans. 8, so they failed and they are broken. And we are placing prep fire on the Germans. Okay, and now these guys, uh, no, I'm going to move them rather than uh, fire, but I'm going to fire with these guys. They have 2 and 5, so they have 7, so I will fire with a uh, strength of 6 against these guys. They are in the stone building, so I will have uh, 6 plus 3 and minus 1, so it is plus 2. 7 plus 2, it is 9. In the 6, it is a miss, I believe. Yes, it is a miss. <coughs> okay. And uh, I think that's all when it comes to the German prep fire phase. Yes? Yes, that's all. So, we can now move our Germans during uh, movement phase. And what Germans are going to do? I think I will start with uh, this uh, squad. It moves one and a half. And now it is in the range of fire of these guys, and they are firing on them with uh, firepower of two. They, we have plus one because of the hinder, uh, hindrance of grain, and uh, minus one because they are moving with non-assault uh, movement. So we have zero with the column of two, four. Oh, this is quite good. Four in the column of two is. One, one MC, so Germans have to ma make a morale check plus one. Oh my, they failed. They failed completely. So they have desperation morale. Americans have plus one. And uh, we, <laughs> we would have a residual fire of one here. But uh, because there is a grain, uh, there is an obstacle, on, sorry, hindrance on the road, on the, uh, uh, on, on the road, so we have zero residual fire. So that was bad. And now we're with this stack. One, two, three. And now they are in the range of fire of these guys. One, two, three, four. So they are firing with the firepower of four. They have minus one before because of the commander, minus two because of uh, moving in the uh, uh, open ground, and minus three because using non-assault movement. So they are firing with this six and minus three. This is going to be very hard for Germans. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Because there is a commander, we don't have to make a shift uh, because of the same uh, roll on the both die. So we are using column of six and we have minu minus three, sorry, minus one. So it is lower than zero. So it is three killed in action. Three German units are eliminated. Oh my. This is uh, very bad for Germans. First fire and two residual fire of two and I think this is a pure disaster for Germans I don't, I don't know if they will be able to do anything uh, more but well let's play till the end 
Okay, so that's uh, all when it comes to the German movement phase. They they don't ca they cannot do much. And next we are moving to the defensive fire phase. So Amer Americans might fire back. And what are they going to fire on? I think here uh, they are firing with the firepower of. Oh, I should remove uh, residual fire. They are firing on this with firepower of six on this stack. And there is a wood, so we have plus one. So it is eleven. So it is a miss. Okay. And uh, do I have any other situations where 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 can I successfully fire on the Germans? <laughs> might 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 try here. I have firepower of three, so I use column of two, and they are in the stone building, so I have plus three. This is epic fail. Okay, and that's all for Americans. Not not. Uh, not much and uh, not, not much uh, other other things they can do okay and next we have advancing fire phase so germans are able to uh, strike their advanced advancing fire but they can uh, they, they don't have any situations where they can so i'm going to s uh, remove prep fire counters from the board Okay, and next is a road phase. So, they are routing to this building. They are routing here and there to this building. And that's all when it comes to the road. Next, next we have advanced phase. So this German squad joins this battle. And that's all, I believe, yes, that's all. And next we have close combat. And now the situation changes because we have here we have eight against seven, so we have one to one. So Germans have to roll five or less. They roll eight, so it is nothing. And Americans are using, uh, are attacking uh, them with uh, all all of them with same odds. And wow, they rolled third, so we remove German units from this hex. They are all eliminated. So this was an extremely lucky uh, situation for uh, Germ for uh, Americans when it comes to this turn because they managed to eliminate uh, to literally obliterate uh, four German squads and two leaders. So that's impressive. So that's all when it comes to the German uh, actions and and now I move to the American actions. Uh, Americans are receiving some reinforcements as well. They are entering through the north edge of the board. But uh, so what uh, where I'm going to place them? I think I will place here, here, here and here. Okay, that's where how are they going to enter? And we are starting with rally uh, with uh, try attempt with our attempts to rally broken units. First here, we have one unit with eight. We have nine. We rolled nine. We have minus one because of the leader and minus one because of the building. So they are rallied. And next, this unit, we rolled 7, plus uh, minus 1 because of the building, and minus 1 because of the commander, it is 5, and plus 4, it's 9, so it's bigger than 8, so they are not rallied. And now, them, 4, plus 4, it's 8, minus 1 because of the building, it is 7, so they are rallied. And now Germans, uh, they have uh, their wounded commander here, tries, he tries to rally himself. He finally managed to do so. So he might try to rally his uh, troops as well. 
Oh my. Okay, this uh, squat is uh, halved to the half squat and the other squat. Wow, it is It is, uh, okay, it is uh, fine. If if he would uh, do self rally and rolled uh, natural one and one, he would gain a field promotion. So he would uh, be turned into a unit of the better quality. But since it was his commander's job here to rally him, then we get no uh, field promotion. Okay, that's all when it comes to the prep fire phase, sorry, to the close, uh, to the rally phase, I believe. Yes, we can remove rem remaining desperation morale counters, and next we are moving to the prep fire phase. Uh, Americans are able to fire with their prep fire, and I am starting here with this, this uh, American squad firing on this German stack. They have firepower of 6 and plus 1 because of the woods. Oh, this is fail. Alright, so uh, next, any other American stacks that are, that are about to fire? Hmm, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so, no. Uh, so we can move to the American movement phase. Okay, let's move Americans then. And uh, I'm going to move this uh, um, half squat one, two and half, four, and now them one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and they are going to fire on them. This will be very hard, be, uh, this, uh, this can be hard because uh, they have to half their strength, so they firing with 2, and they have minus 1 and minus 2 modifier, so... Wow! And first we have to make a column shift because of the same result, so we move from the 2 to 1, and then we have 2, minus 2, it's 2, so we have 1 MC. So first we have to make a call, uh, test for the commander. 8 plus 1, it's 9. He is pinned. So he is not broken, but he cannot use, he, he cannot be uh, used for us uh, in this phase. So next for this squad, they are broken. And for this half squad, they are broken as well. Well, huh. Sometimes Germans can be are, are lucky as well, but not that it's going to help them much, I believe. Okay, so first fire and residual fire. Okay, and now uh, the other American units. Now these guys, one, two, three, four, five, and now Germans may fire on them as well. They have strength of 2 and minus 2. Mm. They are incredibly lucky. Uh, we have 2, minus 3 minus 2, it's 1. 1 in the column of 2, it is killed in action. American squad is instantly eliminated. So, we flip them. And that's all. So this American squad performs a, a assault movement. They move, sorry, half squad. They move here, spending uh, all their uh, movement points. So Germans are able to fire on them, but it will be their final protective fire. So this uh, roll will be also a, a morale check for this German unit. Eight. So they failed, so they are broken and they had there was eight minus one because there's it's a clear terrain so it was seven in the column of two 
it is enough. Sorry, in the, in the column of four because we had our st uh, our firepower halved because of the final protective fire and doubled because we are firing on the adjacent hex. So it was four, uh, seven in the column of four. We have pin test check. So we have we we have to make a pin test check for Americans. They failed, <laughs> so they are still pinned. Okay, and <coughs> next this stack. I'm going to leave this commander with this uh, squad to rally, rally it f further, but one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Next, this stack. One, two, three, four, five, six, because they are moving with their commander. And I think that's all. I think that's all. That I'm not going to move any of these units here. They are fine where they are. So that's all when it comes to the American movement phase. And <clears throat> next we have German defensive fire phase. So Germans might fire. Well, not much they can do. They have seven, fi seven uh, firepower points here. And they are firing on these guys. So they have 6, plus 3 and minus 1. This is uh, 7. 7 in the column of 6. It is normal morale check. So we do normal morale check for Americans. And they failed. Hmm, interesting. So they are broken. Okay, oh, I forgot to remove this residual fire. And uh, no other German units are able to fire, so that's all for defensive fire. Next we have advancing fire phase. And again, not much Americans can do. They uh, There is a little chance for them, because they, their strength could be halved to one, and there is plus one because of the grain and plus one because of the wood so they would fire with firepower and of one and plus two modifier so it's miss and now they they would have uh, their strength halved because of the uh, advancing fire so it's one and half then it is halved because of the pin so it is zero seventy five and this is uh, so it would be one and it is uh, half it is doubled because we are firing on the adjacent hex so i'm firing with the strength of two and uh, plus three four plus three is seven in the column of one it is a miss so nothing and that's all when it comes to the prep fire Okay, and next we have road phase. So, I have two broken units here that have to road, so they are moving here and there. Hope this commander will rally them. And as for Germans, this they they are in the they are moving here, and now. They moved on the clear terrain, which is in the range of fire of the enemy unit. So they have to make a morale check. And if they are failed, they, they are about to suffer reduction. They have 8, their morale is 7, so they are reduced. And they finally retreat on this packs okay uh, also oh i forgot to remove this counter uh, as for them i think i will let them stay here i don't have my uh, i i don't have to uh, remove them because the, there is a building and i hope they might be able to uh, be uh, to to be rallied later. So that's all when it comes to the road phase and next we have advance phase so I can advance my American uh, units here, 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 
here and they are those with pin uh, cannot be uh, ad cannot advance and next we have close combat phase but we have no close combat on the board so I can remove all the pin counters and that's all for the turn 3 so we are moving to the turn 4 so we have turn 4 we are starting with uh, German phases and first we have a rally phase oh I forgot to place a di desperation morale counter here because every time a broken unit uh, is on the adjacent hex to the enemy good order unit it is marked with desperation morale alright so we are starting with rally phase we have no uh, reinforcements in this uh, turn so uh, st let's rally our units first Americans they have one uh, broken unit here so I'm trying to rally it they are right and two units with uh, desperation morale counter so I have to try to rally them as well first the squad it is six plus four it is ten minus one of because of the commander and minus one because of the building so it is eight and they have uh, eight because it is squad so they are rallied and now half squad seven plus four it is eleven minus one because of the building and minus one because of the commander commander it is nine so it is not enough they are not rallied where else okay here I can try self rally on this unit so they have minus one because of the building and plus one because of the self rally eight so they uh, they they are still broken as for Germans hmm I might try to rally this broken unit eight minus uh, one because of the building it is still too much so they are still broken uh, they are fine they cannot be routed, sorry, rallied and they cannot be rallied so I'm removing the desperation morale counter from here but I keep the desperation morale counter here because they are still on the adjacent hex to the enemy unit so that's all when it comes to the rally phase and next we have German prep fire phase so, uh, are Germans going to do any prep fire? Hmm. I don't think so. I think I would rather move uh, my remaining German troops. So, I'm moving to the German movement phase. And I'm starting here. I'm going to keep, uh, let this commander stay, here, stay to uh, rally this the other broken unit. And I make uh, uh, assault movement on this hex. So these Americans may fire on them. They have firepower of 7, so they have 6. Minus 1 because of the commander. Plus 1 because of the orchard. And minus 1 because enemy in, on, in the clear terrain. So we have uh, 6 with minus 1. It is 11, so it is a miss. And I place residual fire of 2 here and I cannot move any further because it was assault movement and I place desperation morale counter on this American broken unit and uh, then I'm making uh, assault movement here and I'm firing with these guys I have to check if I can I first if you declare you have to fire if you find that you don't have a line of sight to the enemy unit, this fire is wasted. So I have a line of sight. So I'm firing with 3, so it's going to be 2. 2, uh, and they are using assault movement, so we have 2, again, and with modifier of 1. Oh, 4 minus 1, it's 3. 3 in the column of 2 is 1 MC. So, first a morale check for the commander. 9, 
plus one it's ten so he failed he is broken next for his guys they passed and now because their leader is broken they have to take another morale check with his uh, leadership modifier as negative modifier still they fail they passed so only commander is broken and now I make a assault, assault movement with them here oh I should place residual fire on that hex and now they move here with assault movement as well these Americans are firing on them so one two three four they are in the range they are firing with the firepower of six plus one because of the orchard and uh, oh I forgot about one thing when you are firing through the hindrance you don't get a modifier for uh, enemy moving in the open ground so they are get six plus one it is 8 and because of the, the same result on the buff die we have to move uh, on the uh, uh, one column shift so we have 4 plus, uh, nine, plus 1 it's 9 so it's nothing so okay so that's all when it comes to the German movement I believe uh, yes uh, no other German units are able to move so I'm going to remove uh, residual fire counters alright and next we have defensive fire phase I'm starting here this uh, half squad fires on this uh, broken squad they have firepower of 3, but it is doubled because they are firing on the adjacent hex, so they have 6, 6 plus 1, it is 7, in the column of 6, it is normal morale check, it is 7, and it is 7, so uh, German, Germans passed. Hmm. As for the others, oh, I should place this counter here, I forgot, I made a mistake, sorry. And as for the others, I think uh, I cannot fire anymore, because I... Uh, oh, okay, they fired as well, so they both fired. They, since they fired on this unit, and they fired on them. So that's, uh, that's what happened here. And I think, yes, that's all when it comes to the defensive fire phase. So I remove defensive fire counters, counters from the board. And I move to the uh, advancing fire phase. So Germans are launching their advancing fire. And I'm going to, per, uh, to prefer, make a fire group of these three units to fire on this American unit together. So they have four because they, the strength, the, their firepower is halved, and then the, then it's doubled because of firing on the adjacent hex. So it is four, it is uh, two. So we have six, and they have uh, they have uh, assault fire modifier. So they have two and half, then five, and plus one it's six. So they have six and six. We have twelve. Uh, we have 12 against uh, with plus 3 modifier oh that's bad 9 plus 3 it's 12 in the 12 it is nothing and that's all because Germans can cannot fire anymore and next we have a road phase so uh, these Americans have to road because they cannot stay here and now because they are here and they are in the range of fire from Germans they have to make a morale check 8 their morale is 8 so they passed and they moved to this building and then here hoping to be rallied by their, by their troops and now they uh, they cannot road here or there because there is uh, the, the, these hexes are adjacent to the enemy units 
enemy unit so they are leaving the board so they because of that they are eliminated and that's all when it comes to the road phase we are moving to the advance phase and now <coughs> Germans are advancing here here and, and there oh I forgot to route these guys here okay that's all yes that's all when it comes to the German advance phase and we have close combat phase but we have no close combat on the board so this concludes the German actions in this turn so let's make American actions now and we are starting with rally phase I'm going to rally this uh, half squad I rolled 7 <laughs> minus 1 because of the commander minus 2 because of the building they are rallied and now here I'm going to rally this squad 7 uh, plus 4 because of the desperation morale and minus 1 because of the building so they are not rallied <coughs> and uh, as for Germans this commander tries to self rally oh so he is not rallied at all and this commander tries to rally unit 9 he failed so I think that's all when it comes to rally phase, yes, because there are no reinforcement coming, reinforcements coming, so we have prep fire phase next. And now what Americans are going to do in the prep fire phase. So they are about to fire, I believe. And I am firing with these guys on them. I have firepower of 7, so 1, 2, 3, 4, so I have... 6 plus 1 because of the orchard and minus 1 because of the commander so we have no uh, f uh, so we have no modifier and it is 10 it is a miss and any other units that are about to prep fire no i don't think so hmm. i might try to fire on them with this squad but there is a little chance, so no. Okay, that's all. And next is going to be a movement phase for uh, Americans and what Americans are go where Americans are going to move. Uh, starting here, one and half, two and half, three and half. So that's all. One, two and half, four. That's all. And because of that I have to place Desperation Morale counter here. And then this commander, he moves alone. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This half squad moves 1, 2, 3, 4. And we place a Desperation Morale counter on these uh, Germans. And now this uh, this squad moves one, two, and now they are in the range of fire of this German squad, and so Germans are firing on them with the firepower of four and minus two because uh, open ground and non assault movement. It is nine, minus two it is seven. In the column of four it is pin test check. They failed, so they are pinned. And first fire for these Germans. Next, they are moving. One, two. Three, four. They are joining this, this team. And next, this group moves as a stack. One, two, three, four, five. 6 and that's all when it comes to the German sorry American movement phase so I can remove this 
residual fire. Next we have German defensive fire phase. So Germans can fire and where they can fire. I think I will try to hit these guys. One, two, or I have to check if I have a line of sight to them first. Yes, I have, but because but it leads through the orchard, so I have one, two, three, four, five. So I have a fire power of one, and I have minus one because of the orchard. Sorry, plus one because of the orchard. So I'm firing with one and plus one. It is nine, so it is a miss. And no other German units may fire. So that's all. I remove. Uh, defensive fire counters and next we have advancing fire so uh, Americans are able to make any successful advancing fire yes I think they can starting here they have three it is halved and then it's doubled so it is two plus one because of the woods it is five it is five so it is six in the column of two it is pin test check so nothing because uh, Germans are already broken now here, same situation. Oh, not, not the same because we have plus two because of the wooden building. Again, it is a miss. Mm. As for the other um, Americans, I might use them. One, two, three, four, five. No, so that would be... A... No. No, I don't think so. It, it, it doesn't make much sense to try. So that's all when it comes to the prep fire phase. And next we have a road phase. So these Germans cannot road because the <coughs> both possible hexes are in the uh, are na adjacent to the enemy, so they are eliminated. These Germans still can road here to these woods and uh, there are no other units that would may be forced to road, no. So that's all when it comes to the road phase and next we have advanced phase so I can advance with my Americans. One, 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 one and one. And we have no uh, close combat. I think I move them here. I will leave one squad here and move one squad here with commander. And uh, so I can remove pin. And this concludes turn 4. We can start with a turn 5. It will be the last turn of the game and you can see the situation is well. Not quite good for Germans, they suffered heavy losses, so they, they're probably going to lose this battle. And so we are starting the last turn of our game, and first we have a rally phase, so let's check what Germans can do. First, this commander might rally himself. Three, he made it. And now this. This commander might try to rally this unit. Eight. Minus one because of the building, so he failed. And now they might try to rally themselves, but it would be very hard. Like I said. And so we cannot remove this desperation morale counter, because there is enemy unit on the adjacent hex. And now Americans, uh, there is I think one broken unit here, yes, it is, five, so they are rallied, and alright, that's all when it comes to the rally phase. Next we have prep fire phase, and now uh, Germans have to think about their strategy. Uh, well, I think that firing is not the best option. If Germans uh, uh, want to win, they have to capture one of these buildings, or one of these, but let's, t let's uh, face the truth, these are out of their reach, while these two, well, are slightly better. 
So let's try. I'm making a salt movement here. And so, so, so I skip prep fire phase. I'm moving into movement phase. And I'm firing on them with this unit. I have a firepower of 6. And I have plus 3 because of the building. And since enemy makes assault movement, I don't get minus 1. It is 6. It is a double. So I move to 4. And 6, six plus 3 is a 9. In the column of 4, it is a miss. So they get first fire and residual fire of 2. And now uh, this, uh, uh, this unit may fire on them as well. They have 14 because they are firing on the adjacent hex. So it is 12 plus 3. It is 9 again. 9, uh, so it's 9 in the fourth. It, it is normal morale check. Seven, and they have seven, so they are pinned. And we have to remove this residual fire of two and find residual fire of six. Okay, that was, well, not quite good. Because they are pinned, so they won't be able to move here during the advance phase. Okay, next, next one. They are moving here. It is their normal move. Oh, I forgot to place first fire here. And now these guys are firing on them. They have <coughs> seven, so there is six. Minus one because of the commander. Minus one because of the non-assault movement. So they are firing with six and minus two. Oh my! <laughs> it is three. Minus two, it's one. In the column of six, it is Two killed in action. And it is even a single unit, so they are eliminated. Okay, and then we have to place first fire and two here. Okay, and uh, the last chance for Germans is here. These guys are moving on this hex. And now I think these guys might fire on them. One, two, three, four, five, six. So they have to half their firepower. They have three, they have seven, so they have three and half. They have three and half as well, so it's seven. And they have one and half, so it is eight and half, so it is eight. Eight uh, minus one because of the commander. And. Minus 2 because of non-assault movement, so it is minus 2. It is 7, minus 2 it's, is 5. 5 in the column of 8, it is 2 MC. It is 4 plus 2, it's 6, so they passed. So they passed. I'm pre placing here residual fire of 4. First fire counter here, and now they are moving here. Sorry, they are moving here. So, one, two, three, and four. This is the, their last desperate attempt. First, this uh, this uh, half squad is firing on them with the firepower of two and minus two. It is six. Six in the column of two is pin test check. So they failed residual fire of one okay and uh, now this american unit may fire on them as well it will be the, uh, they are firing with firepower of six because they have their uh, strength uh, halved because of the a final fire and then uh, doubled because of the adjacent hex. So they are firing with 6 and minus 2. It is 5 in the column of 6. It is 1 MC. 8. It is 9. So Germans are broken. So 
that's all when it comes to the German uh, uh, last attempt uh, to capture this building. So I think I can uh, end the game here, because it is impossible for Germans to do anything now. Why, you may ask. Uh, uh, they are broken and they are pinned. So uh, I think they cannot uh, do much, because, well, they cannot move. If they are, they are pinned, so they won't be able to move during their advent phase. <clears throat> they are broken, so they won't be able to move. Uh, to move, they will have to rot here. So that's, uh, I think, the end of the game. We we can st we can uh, finish uh, the game now because Germans are unable to achieve their victory. Uh, so uh, that's all when it comes to this video. I hope uh, it was uh, go good, uh, handy helpful maybe and uh, I'm sorry if I made any mistakes I did my best to do nothing uh, to, uh, to do no mistakes at all but it's uh, well it is an ad advanced squad leader so there is always a, a little chance to make some mistakes if but even so uh, I hope this might uh, show you how this great game works and I plan to record more of the advanced squad leader videos so uh, see you next time and thank you for watching